locked in to Trini Spikes FM, bringing you the best known and less known soca, Caribbean and urban music. Good vibes. Good vibes only. Make I go love you, Jaja. 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 Make I go love you, Tenda. Tenda. Trini Spice FM. I want to say good morning, good morning. Welcome to Trini Spice FM's Island Brunch. Um, I'm your host, Reagan, DJ PRS1. I messed up my own name, man. <laughs> DJ PRS1 Gaiety. Uh, along with my co-host, my sister, my ace, my only sister that we know about, um, D- <laughs> Dr. Alicia G. And our special like guest today is the sweetheart of Soka. <laughs> <laughs> the one, the only Ray. All right. Good morning. Good morning, good morning everybody. Good morning. How are everybody having a good Saturday? So, so Alicia, how, how was your Saturday, Alicia, so far? So far... Good. We have a little bit of. I'm. I'm in. I'm in Florida. You know, sunny Florida, which is a little cloudy right now. But um, typical Saturday. I wish I had a doubles vendor down the street that I could just roll up on. But that's just how it is. But um, Ray. Yes. How are you, my dear? <laughs> I am well. I am well. No complaints. Sweetheart of Soka, Sweetheart Saturday. Oh, <laughs> yes. I like that. I like mm-hmm. that. Yeah. So, yes. Ray. Trini Spice FM, Sweetheart. <laughs> For all of you <laughs> out there listening right now, yeah. um, you are a well established Soka artist out there. I mean, your, your music is fire. I mean, I could listen to that stuff all day. Thank mm-hmm. you. And it just puts me in a mood that I just want to I just want to move yeah and that's right. that, that's just what it is mm-hmm. but we want to know who is Ray who is this authentic per- who is this person that's just that just come out there and like <laughs> ah, 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 ah. Ray <laughs> who is this who is this this girl jump on the scene yes yeah. um <laughs> well I'm a very creative hard working go getter and I think that that's who I am across the board, you know, in music, outside of music. When I want something, I go and I get it. And it doesn't matter what it is and I've done it numerous times in different dynamics in different areas. But when I see something that I know that I'm passionate about, I just go for it. I am I, I a lot of people consider me to be like a leader, an outspoken person, and I definitely take in those roles because I do think that that reflects who I am. I'm very caring, and I like to just tell people I'm a human being. Like, I'm a human being like everybody else. You know what I'm saying? People see a lot of stuff with, I guess, me out there now, and forget that I'm still just human, just like you, just like anybody, you know, I have a day-to-day life, you know, and... That's just me in a nutshell. I'm fun, I'm loving, and but I'm real. I, you know, you ask me anything and I'm gonna give you real answers. I don't really like to do the pretend kind of kind of thing. No. And, that, and and you know what? That's what it, that's what it's all about. You yeah. know, it's just getting to know this this person. Because when you're when you're performing, that's what you're doing. You know, you're performing. You have an audience, and your audience came there to to get you know, riled up, they came to get a performance out of this world and you deliver that 110%, 50, 200, whatever you do. But mm-hmm. like Saturday morning, it's like 10 o'clock. Yeah. What is Ray about on a day to day? <laughs> well, um, my Saturdays vary. So for today, I literally got up in time to organize for this. <laughs> I wouldn't like to hear. I wouldn't like to hear. That's not always how my Saturdays go. Sometimes right. I'm up early. I'm tending to my house, making breakfast. You know those kind of things. Or I hop in my car. I run and I run. I don't like to keep still. I don't like to be bored. So all my Saturdays are very different. Like it's not the same thing over and over and over. So today for today, I can tell you, I'm a Saturday non-start. So right, right, <laughs> nice. right. 
Nice. But well, usually, this, is, right. is this the only time you just wake up usually though? <laughs> on a Saturday? Um, I, maybe like around 9. Like right, at 8, sure. 30, 9. Sometimes I get lucky and maybe it's like at 10, 10, 30. <laughs> but... <laughs> That's good. That's so good. You could just relax. Yeah. Right. I think 2018, was it 2018? Mm -hmm. Was your first official carnival on the scene. And and the whole carnival experience from a different side of the table, I should say. Because, you know, from being an audience, somebody in the audience to now being on the live stage and, and, and performing and, and doing all that stuff. How was that, you know, as it's so fresh in your mind? Well, first for 2018 is when I just like started recording and things like that. 2019 right. is when we put all the music for the carnival season. Gotcha. Um, <clears throat> that was, um, that was like being thrown into the deep end, to be honest. Um, right. I, don't, I don't think anybody anticipated that mm -hmm. it was going to go how it went, you know? Right. We knew that I was coming out with these songs. We knew that we had a goal in hopes that it even made it to radio. You know what I'm saying? That was right, the first right, right. Like, Let's get these songs yeah. on radio. And yeah. um, once that happened, it's like, okay, well, you know, my manager was like, who wasn't my manager at the time, but um, he was like, listen, if you're going to do this, you have to do groundwork. Like, you right. can't be there and missing things here like you had to be here so i was like all right cool say less I i'm there everywhere like nah you had to be here for the season i was like mm -hmm. the whole season He's yes like, yeah, the whole season so literally like july 3rd, i mean sorry january 3rd i was on a plane to trinidad and i literally on the plane getting my makeup done to go to the avenue to perform and right. it, it never stopped from that point and throughout the whole season everybody was like Gil do you understand like nobody let me forget everybody was like are you understanding what's going on right now yeah, like, you, right. you know you know no reach and you just going 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 performance mm -hmm, performance, mm -hmm. performance and I'm yep. just it was honestly scary but amazing and I was so grateful for it to understand that this not this is not even the norm. Like this is not right. what typically would have happened for somebody that's now jumping out on the scene and um, things like that. So I took advantage of those opportunities, put my big yellow panties on. I was like, yo, <laughs> let's let's do this. We here. I came for a reason. I know right. it's gonna work. No complaints. Like we just we, we had to do what we had to do. Yeah. Okay. So I know. Cool. Who's like an, an artist that you were able to work with and you felt as if this is a person that really just might have your back all the time? So quite a few, to be honest. Um, I've been lucky in the sense that a lot of people had a willingness in them to allow me to either go on stage with them or work with me overall. Um, there was Dev. Dev let me run on plenty times with him for the season. Moto right. brought me out with him a couple times as well. And mm -hmm. my boy, college boy, just me, yo. Right, right. If there was, if there was anybody, no, big up everybody who gave me the opportunities. Shout out to everybody who saw something in me from the beginning that gave me that chance. But definitely, college boy Jesse, I would have to literally say that is more than just he gave me a chance like he went a little bit beyond what everybody right. else did like he learned my songs and even when he brought me on like he never left he stayed on stage and he he backing me up with my song and, he, right, right. and i'm like i came off stage like you know you, you're up there so you're adrenaline rushing but it's right. like when i come off now i'm like yo was he singing like yeah you got that's your hype man <laughs> yeah and, and that honestly that meant so much to me because right Jesse's he's such he's a hype man. performer yeah like he's such a performer he gives so much on that stage and he dedicates right. so much so this is before our friendship even existed to know that somebody mm -hmm. took that time and, right. that and they didn't have to implement a lot and then as the friendship grew now it's like i know if i hit jesse up today and be like yo jesse like i need help with xyz he, he will hold me down, you know, and then right. now we collab, so you know, things like that just continue to grow and, and definitely. And same thing on this end, like if there's anything I could do, even on my end, I have right. a job. like it's a family thing at this point. Mm -hmm. is, 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 is it terrible now with, with COVID and, and the lockdown and all this kind of thing? It kind of it, it is like it give you a, a, a teaser and then it pull you back now, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So I had a I had like a like a i guess like a panic attack <laughs> right 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 
when everything was over because we made we made an impression like we made an impression yeah, um, definitely. it was it was good and it had so many things following up from that that it was like yo we hit the ground running and we continuing to go after carnival and then covid came and it was like no 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 not today mm-hmm. <laughs> so my first thing you know in talking to my manager was like okay at this point i'm not a patrice i'm not a nyla i'm like what is going to happen when and how you stay go? relevant right right am i gonna have to start all over again am i gonna have to do this wrong this wrong work again like i cannot allow people to forget what they who ray is to forget exactly. who ray is right so it's like right. all these things going through my mind and i'm just like nah like we gotta stay on top we gotta yeah and i hold it now i'm like what we could put on what we could do what we could you know right right <laughs> in the beginning to a lot of people weren't willing to continue putting on music like um, right. producers they would have rhythms and there was so, there's so many things that has not been released that i've been a part of that producers were just like we had to gauge this we had to see like there's no kind of a like what's going to happen like does it make sense putting this out so now you're trying to find the producers that's willing to put things out willing to take that risk during this right. where you know we we are the kind of genre that's relying on this kind of a season and even that had a change you know mm-hmm. so i was there with like no i don't care like if somebody's willing i don't care that there's no kind of a, like something out of release something out of happen i'm like yeah, I'm, gotta not, go. i'm like literally watching the months go by and i'm like no 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 like i'm right. holding him right? like i thirsty <laughs> yeah. so i think once i started to see that something was about to come Mm-hmm. It kind of it it pushed me back into that mind frame now. Like, okay, well, work is gonna happen, and I am not gonna allow myself to just sit here. So then, TikTok popped up. <laughs> right, 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 right. That worked out. That worked out though, because it, yeah. it, it kept you there. I say everybody know about Ray on TikTok. So. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> so it was like, okay, and well, I think you even had. Did you have a whining challenge? You, you had some type of challenge. You had put there's up. a challenge right now. There's a this right, right. A challenge. So I've yeah. had a challenge before. I've had the destruction challenge. Right, and right. I have the sweetest wine challenge for the latest release. Right, so right. That's going well. I'm really excited <laughs> to continue to see the entries kind of pour in with everybody's version of whatever their sweetest wine is and stuff like that. And that's and, and that's that helps. That helps. That helps. That helps. Stay, helps you stay relevant. Helps you stay, helps you stay relevant. Helps push that you. mode. Right. Exactly. Exactly. And that and that's really what it was so once we developed like okay well once me and my manager got on the same page like okay ray want to work like ray want to put out things it's just a matter of now remaining consistent is is pushing your own material because things right. are starting to open back now outside of trinidad so right. the opportunities right. are starting to come back in to perform and things like right. that and come in so i think that's going to start to fill back up spaces as to how you stay relevant and how you mm-hmm. get yourself out there but for what had to exist in the meantime yo people i'll be real with you right i do not like making tiktoks i don't care what anybody <laughs> says i don't like it's time it's effort yeah. you know what i'm and, saying and, 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 and imagination because you got to put you got to think up what you're about to do before right exactly so trust me, I had a couple. <laughs> and people sit there and they watch it and they're like yo ray be on tiktok like trust me when i tell you <laughs> it's worked. i had a choice TikTok would, be work. Good, would be good off on TikTok. Then it's like you had to learn to edit your video and you slip in here and you cut it. Listen. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, yeah. It's a lot of work. And people it's don't realize real. it. They it's make work. it look so people easy on TikTok. Videos, right. They enjoy the videos, but it's work. It yeah. is work. So yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. That's good, man. <laughs> All right. So I know we do this thing where we ask, you know, um wait, which one we gonna go with Alicia? Um well, Carib Carib or Stag? Mm. I'm not a big drinker, but if I had to choose one, it would be Stag. Okay, okay. Okay, I have one. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Malta or Shandy? Oh God. Oh my gosh, that's a hard one. <laughs> um, Sorrel Shandy. Woo! Damn. Yeah, yeah. I, I was thinking. How's that Malta. difficult one though? I was thinking Malta. It's hmm. a, it's a, it's a tough, it's a tough. That's one. a tough one. Yeah. yeah, I I think it's the mood though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm having a Malta right. mood. Yeah, I'm having right. a Shandy mood, but Shandy sorrel. Oh, no, right. depending on the flavor of the Shandy, I might always go with Malta because for me, it's the sorrel Shandy. So anything yeah. else, yes. sorrel, sorry, yeah. like Christmas, Malta right. would have been. Yeah, 
that's that's a Regan favorite. Mm-hmm. Sorry, Shandy. Is, sorry. Yeah. I get drunk off of Sarah Shandy one <laughs> <Sorry, crazy. laughs> I have an aunt. I have an aunt. She can, she can make like same thing. She take right. I vomit. I vomit with that damn Shandy. It was crazy. <laughs> I drink till I vomit. My, my, my cousin take me, it was like 9 o'clock in the morning, we're going in this bar. And you know, in Trinidad, you said, I'm in the bar, and you bring our rooms, bring our rooms, bring our rooms. I wasn't drinking. So I was not drinking at the time. So, um, them knocking back beers. And every time a rooms that beers come, a, a red shandy show up. So I drink <laughs> that. Man, I drink shandy till it was coming up my ears. I say, Lord, oh boy. <laughs> I was throwing up shandy. I can't I believe like, this. This boy drunk on shandy. Yeah, this boy, like, I didn't even know that could happen. That was crazy. So, so Ray, yeah, you, 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 you just take like, um, like you're in Maryland, right? Yeah, right now, yeah. Okay, so when you want your fix for like your home food, you cooking it or you out there <clears throat> cooking it? Um, if I'm in Maryland, I'm cooking it. If I'm in New York. Going oh, yeah. I go yeah. in yes. Exactly. Exactly. That's That's the same so thing doubles, I do. Or, doubles or Sahina? Doubles. <laughs> That's my I love my doubles. <laughs> yes. Kalalua right. Oh, there she going again. Ooh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Pelau. <laughs> Pelau. Um, <laughs> That's the thing for carnival self, you know, some good peel out. Yeah. Things I do, I think. With some pigeon peas. <laughs> yeah. Regan, Regan wife could put on some good peel out. Yeah. Some good peel out. So. I picture only peel out. So, Ray. Yeah. What? Who, who is uh, an artist you feel like you desire to want to work with? Yes. yes. You want to work with. Um, that if you could reach out to that person today yeah. and say, let's collab. Yes, Who would yeah, that person be? One artist to work out with today and they tell you no, it, no restrictions. Who are you pulling? Um, so just based on the Well, first of all, I really don't sit down and think that deep into that because for me, it's really just about building me right now and I know that right. things will come. But that, that's what we hear. But, but if... If it was a no questions asked, and I know people are gonna say I'm biased when I say this, but they would have to be cast. <laughs> they would have to be cast. No, I mean, I swear, cast was out on this show. Uh, so far, we had four minutes to be the fourth episode, and everybody so far cast. Yeah, but, but it's <laughs> more. Boy. It's more than just about his celebrity. Is is like watching him work, watching his yeah. drive, watching all his passion, forms, watching his, his, his talent. Is the passion yeah, behind like, music? Exactly, yeah. exactly. I, I know passion some for the music. I know some. The boy get hoarse when he sing with Iwa. You know, you know that passion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Until he couldn't sing. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. Right. Education, like yeah, and some people I think will just watch it as Kess is it. So it's like yeah. why not Kess? But you don't I ever like, get you don't ever get uh, what fifty percent. You don't ever get ninety percent. With Kess, you're always getting a hundred over to almost two hundred percent. Exactly, 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 exactly. You get like, what you pay for. You get everything. I see Kess as like the best. It's like why yeah. wouldn't you want to? Put yourself there with the best. Right. You're going to challenge yourself. Like, oh, you gotta come to Kess. You gotta come good. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, I'd have to say Kess. <laughs> well, I definitely think that's like a lot that could happen. Yeah. Because you know, Ray, you you're talented. You're talented. So that's out there. That we we put in that out there in the universe. Yes. That's coming out. That's coming out. We're putting that out there. <laughs> You're close enough because it was on the actual rhythm with yeah. him this year. That was a good yeah. thing. You yeah. made it to the rhythm. Yeah. So at least we mix in you before we drop Kess or, or, or Kess before we drop you. You know, it's you, college boy, y'all had rocked that rhythm, yo. Yeah, yeah. Because that was you good. can't just hear the Kess. You have to hear Ray is whole day. You have to hear whole day dropping in. You know what I mean? It was, yeah, yeah. You, you rocked the rhythm. Thank you, I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah, that was that was a, that in itself was such a dope opportunity. I call it right my, my rhythm of kings. Like I, it was it was really an amazing. Yes, yeah, and you did a great job. It, it was it, man, you did an awesome job. I wouldn't even say great. It was an awesome job you did on that one. Thank you, thank you. Exceptional, <laughs> exceptional. Now mm-hmm. you sound a little hoarse now. Um, yeah. 
so I performed last week in Culture Fest and um, just a lot of the networking that came afterwards, the music load and things like that. And I then other stuff, allergies and stuff too. So sometimes in the morning in general, I just, just wake up a little sounding groggy because the allergies from the season I performed last week. So it'll get better as the day go on. But I do usually have a relatively raspy voice. It's just a little extra in the morning. Right, right. <laughs> So what 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 it is you're working on right now that that your fans could look forward to coming through like you know summertime, yeah. winter time, you know what 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 we could look forward to with Bree. So right now we do have Sweetest Wine out that released a few weeks ago and we have the challenge going for that. So whoever has not jumped on that challenge yet, we don't want to miss it. You're getting Live Love Soca merch, as a, you know, as I don't have one already. And then on top of that, they get in $100 cash prize as well for the winner. Um, outside of what currently exists, we have quite a few things coming that I don't even know if I'm allowed to technically say, but there's a collab, there's an EP, um, there's a few rhythms that I'm on as well that are releasing with some great, great people on the cast for the rhythms. So definitely stay tuned because I just can't really leak what coming, what thing coming. <laughs> and we, we, we feel you on that one, but we appreciate that you could even share that with us so that, right. you know, your fans out there could look forward to something like what else coming because yeah. You know, right now we live in, in a, a little bit of a time of uncertainty. Yeah. So, you know, it's so important for people to have something to look forward to and and to definitely know that, you know what, Ray's still on it. Yeah, definitely. Right, right. You know, and she out there and she, she working and, you know, we have stuff to look forward to where it comes to, to Ray. So, definitely... Um, now, with regards to performing, mm -hmm. I have a question. Yes. Because I feel as if, as a performer, you have certain desires, and I, this might be deep too, which, mm -hmm. I don't know, makes me like old and old in my soul. <laughs> but what platform, what stage would you want to see yourself on, like, future ones? That is because what you're doing thing. now, you're moving yourself. You're yeah. definitely moving yourself. So you're, you're. I definitely think your journey is moving you in a direction. So when you think about, you know, wow, I just this thing take off. We running with it. Where where do you feel like you want to go? Where you want to be? I mean, besides from wanting to be able to hold my own concerts, you know, in Trinidad when it's carnival season and things like that. I mean, I got to go big, right? So it's like, yeah. the garden. <laughs> I mean, Madison Square. Oh, yes. I mean, hey, I, I could, hear you. If I could put on Marcel and, and end up on Madison Square and, and sell out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're more than rich. <laughs> right. You have to walk That's again. Right. That's right. <laughs> and you know what? what i what i think and you know regan and i we agree with this you know artists like like yourself you are the you're it it's you guys that are taking the music outside of just trinidad yeah mm -hmm. you know and you're really giving it life and love and you and you have people all over the world mm -hmm. you know appreciating what it is and so even being on TikTok and all that it's like you're you're spreading yourself yeah. You know, but you're not only just spreading Ray, you're spreading that love and that passion for soca and, and that music and you know what um our little island has to offer. So yeah. you know, what what are you um what are you what do you think you want your fans to know moving forward with regards to Ray? Well, first, I want them to know that I'm so grateful for them, number one. Like, I came here, you know, in a sense, just the other day, and the kind of love and support that I've gotten from fans. I don't even like that word. I don't like the word fans. Um, to me, it's... I like I'm the word... 
no i mean not, not even to be cliche like that like i just see it as bigger than that like i i right. like support that i get for them i just feel like fans is not a good enough word to kind of really explain who what these people mean to me anyway you right, know right. like sometimes you see people you don't know giving you bigger support than people you've known your whole life you know what i'm saying mm-hmm. and that means a lot so I, I first want them to know that i'm so grateful and thankful and blessed to have them and then that to let them know that yo when it comes to me expect an authentic person mm-hmm. and expect a consistent person like that's right my goal to keep being consistent with good music and as well as who you see out there is who you see when you meet me and right. i try my best to kind of make sure to stay grounded and remember that because that is exactly why even when people ask me who is ray in an interview i always like to put in like i'm a human being because that's even a reminder for me like ray you know different from you you know different from you you know different everybody human and we all bleed in the same way so right right it's, right. Just, a, it's just a reminder to just like stay real and it's always been one of my goals and even starting this journey that i want to promise to my supporters that they can expect like you will get a real person so your peeps my peeps your peeps. people girl your people yes yep. i to all your my people people yes. there you go there you go <laughs> that's a game boy <laughs> that's right you know what? Let's get to the top. Let's get to the top. Right. So, really, when, 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 when you're in Trinidad, um, where is home? What part of Trinidad is home? Home is South Trinidad. Um, oh, yeah. South, yeah. okay. Yeah, Santa Flora, Palo like that. Okay, okay, okay. That is where home is. Right. We, so, we from South, too. We from South, hey, too. Hey, South, South. Sando. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> um... But in since this journey started, I will say that where I stay has been in town, St. James. And right, 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 right. But and that's it, just it, because is the is the business, is the hustle and the bustle, mm-hmm. and you know, it is a lot harder to to be trying to commute from south to get you know. So, but home, right. where I was born, home is home, South. South. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Family. So, where uh, we 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 we've, we've born in South. Well, I was born here, but uh, yeah. We were, we, we were we were south people point fourteen yeah, the library yeah. all them areas and um you know it's, it's it's we ended up we ended well now where you know with you know everybody family moving around and stuff like that we end up on that side too you know we end up with the Kuva side the, you know yeah. um Trin City all them areas up there yeah. you know <laughs> yeah so we back up in that area too as well it has happened but I just felt the end of the day right right great. Yeah. When you touch down in Trinidad, mm-hmm. what's the first thing? I know the last time you you went, you, you touched down and you have to you have to go on perform. Make yeah. up and stuff, right? When you touch down in Trinidad, what's the first thing you want to do? Yeah, doubles. <laughs> yes. Hey, look, yes. Look, again, everybody with his doubles, right? Yeah. 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 No, you should cool just make it enough. Well, I was like, where the doubles men now? Yeah. Right. Right. Just that is no doubles. No, 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 doubles is culture. Yeah, <laughs> once that dry start is like yo, find me doubles. Like yes. yeah, doubles. Wear the doubles. Wear the doubles. That's right. What diet you on? A double. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right. Whatever right. diet you on, it goes out the window when you reach Trinidad. Exactly. <laughs> <Yeah>. Exactly. <laughs> you can't go to Trinidad and ain't want to, especially if you're a tourist, a pure tourist. Yeah, you yeah, better yeah. go there to get fat because you exactly. have to try everything. Exactly. What, is, what right. we do? We just party and we just eat. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You go on the savanna, you gain ten pounds rather than yes. lose. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> you go on the savanna and you stop and eat a corn too. Just eat a doubles. You right. drink some coconut water. Oh so my god, that was, good. that was gonna be the next thing I was gonna say. If it wasn't done, yeah. I was gonna yeah. say somebody had to stop. For them to cut open that coconut. And yes. Coconut yes, that is the thing. Yeah. Well, but Ray, we got about three more minutes left. Um, so I guess we're trying to. We're gonna wrap it up. We're gonna try to end it off. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna tell I the folks to right now. From Ray. Exactly right. I mean, you you ended off with, with, with a little, a little acapella something. And, um, <laughs> I am not so judgment, but... <laughs> yeah, no worries, we're in the morning, right? No judgment, no judgment. All right. 
All right, but before we do that, um, to all my listeners out there, all the folks that um, checking us out, um, yes, you'll be able to see this live on, on, on the YouTube. We're also on, it's going to end up being a podcast, so you could always listen to the podcast on almost any platform right now. So far, Apple hasn't picked us up yet. They're still reviewing, but uh, we everywhere. We're everywhere. Apple Music, uh, now Apple Music, Amazon Music, all that stuff. So check us out, Trini Spice FM, download the app. And Ray, take it away, it's all you. Whole day, we walking up whole day, we jamming is whole day, we winding up like I never see come see touchdown is whole day, we fetting hard whole day, well back and all whole day, try stop me now like I never see come see, and then I had to ask them this, how much wine I go wine from TikTok, me, me? I will wine behind big truck, right by the speaker box. Cause I fed up, I fed up, I fed up And I want when I start to throw it Not one thing hide in my face No mask to mess with my cuteness It's bellousness, eh, eh And it's a long, long time I jam It's a long, long time I walk my bump at it Time to come off the gram And I can't lie right now, I need good company Too much energy pent up And it's high time we link up and right now I need a release So when I come out, don't judge me please Cause this whole day That's right Yes, yes, oh yes, God. yes Ladies and gentlemen, that was Ray uh, The sweetheart Ray Yeah, right <laughs> The soca sweetheart Keeping us up this Saturday morning for joining right us. Yes, we want to yes. say thanks for joining us Thanks for listening Folks out there, you know, thanks. So far, I didn't see any comments, but if we do any any comments later, I'll pass it on to Ray. Um, I'll put in the links below, you know, where you can get Ray music, which is almost everywhere right yeah. now. If you if, if you're living under a rock, Ray, you can find Ray's music everywhere. Yeah. You can follow her on Instagram. It's yeah. it's, it's Ray. Ray dot, what what is it? It's Ray dot official and Ray with an E. Yes, right. Ray R A E. Yes. Well, I'll have all that posted on the bottom. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we out. Thanks for watching. Trinity Island Brunch. All right, we out. We out. Woo-hoo.